Hey, good afternoon. This is Alan Buchanan, and welcome to another edition of Thursday Thoughts for your commercial real estate. And today I want to talk to you about your roof. Now, some of you may be thinking to yourself, wow, it's 100 degrees outside. The last thing I want to think about is my roof because the rains aren't due here for another four to five to six months, if at all, in Southern California. And I don't really want to think about my roof until such time as I need to fix a leak. But now is probably one of the best times to think about the roof because this time of year, roofers are not terribly busy and you can get great deals on roof maintenance. I think about your roof in three ways. The maintenance, the repair, and the replacement of that roof. And depending on whether you're a tenant or whether you own your building, those three things are going to vary. Obviously, if you own your building, you're responsible for all three, for the repair, for the maintenance, as well as for the replacement. If you're a tenant in the building, however, that may vary. Typically, in a triple net lease, you're responsible for the repair and also the maintenance of the roof. But when it comes to replacement, if the repair is to such a level, generally the landlord's responsible for replacing your roof, but then he has the right to bill you back over the term of that lease. If you're on a gross industrial lease, generally speaking, the owner, the landlord is responsible for that uh, roof maintenance as well as the repair as well as the replacement. So think about these things. I hope this helps you with your commercial real estate. This is Alan Buchanan saying make it a great week. Until next week on Thursday Thoughts for Commercial Real Estate.